what is up guys welcome back to the channel today we are cleaning an elementary school that is pretty dirty kind of a community project giving back to community um so this project is one i've like heavily heavily discounted for them um it's a title one elementary school i just wanted to help out so yeah we got some stuff to take care of you can see that's pretty dirty got a bunch of concrete to clean around the school um and yeah but we're gonna get it done we're gonna have some fun a little side story so i got here about 12 45 it's about like 2 10 now um I had to like pull my van closer to the school so I can reach everything. And the path that was recommended for me to take, I got stuck, spent about an hour and a half trying to get out, finally made it out and here we are. So we're gonna go ahead and get it knocked out. You know, life is full of ups and downs and challenges, but now it's time to work. Let me show you guys some of the uh, job. I'm also taking pictures as well. But yeah, let me go ahead and flip the camera, show you guys what we got going on. All right, so here we go. See the school's pretty, pretty dirty. Hasn't been clean in a long time. Got all of this to do. Gotta go down that way with the concrete. Doors is dirty. I'm gonna tape off these little things like that. Oh boy. You guys can see my truck is absolutely dirty. The wheels are covered. I'm gonna have to clean that in the parking lot. One solid ground. I'm gonna be cleaning all this concrete up in here. But with the eight GP machine, you know, we should be able to pr move pretty efficiently. <sighs> all right, so I'm gonna stop right here. I'm not gonna take you guys all around yet. You guys will see the other half in a little bit, but I'm gonna go ahead and finish setting up so we can get started. Let's go. All right, guys, so down to my last phase of washing the school, um, which I'll show you guys all around when I'm done. But uh, so far, you know, I've been definitely put in those hours. I've had certain areas where it's more difficult to like, uh, that, caught, that just took me more time. Like um, the concrete cleaning was fast, but there were areas where there wasn't good drainage. So squeegeeing and rinsing the water to, different, to a different area, that took forever. Um, luckily though, this last section I have to do, that should not be an issue with any water. So um, water puddling anywhere. So I estimate, I'm gonna show you guys what I have to do left, but I estimate this last section should take me about an hour and a half. No more than that. I just gotta do the front of the school building pretty much which is pretty easy. And then some concrete, which the concrete shouldn't take me any longer than like 45 minutes to do. So yeah, you guys will see it on GoPro. Yesterday, just got a little bit of a, rough, of a rough start. Didn't get as much done as I wanted to. But yeah, so let me go ahead and uh, finish setting up. I just took a lunch break. Now I gotta reset everything up, get it knocked out and get out of here. Mm, excuse me, working on a Sunday, but gotta do what you gotta do. All right, guys, after putting in about 17 man hours for this project um it is all done um so solo this project out just wanted to see how long it would take me this is the first time i did a project like of this size with my you know current equipment so i just wanted to give it a go and yeah got it done guys um don't even ask me how much i made on this job because uh like i said this earlier this was like kind of like giving back it wasn't a free job but it was like heavily discounted title one school I didn't have much money but i wanted to just help out um, they're trying to attract new kindergartners, so they wanted a cleaner school. So they reached out to me, you know, and I was able to come through. So let me go show you guys kind of like what I did, the scope of the work. You guys can see what I, you know, took care of. And thank God for having the equipment I did because anything less than this, I probably wouldn't even have accepted it. So let me show you guys the finished product. We're going to make this quick. All right, guys. So I cleaned this whole kind of underpass thing over there, cleaned the school. So I cleaned the brick around the trim, up down that sidewalk over here, these sidewalks. Cleaned uh, this thing. So, yeah. So we're gonna go all around. And this is a really old school and their goal wasn't for it to be like perfect, but they just wanted a cleaner school. So I didn't do the upper building. That was way too much. So just this lower building. Hit these stairs, let's just soft wash that hit with some bleach. All the concrete around here, upper, and I should have gave you guys a pre, a before walk around so you guys would be able to see the total scope of the project. So all around here, all the concrete you're seeing, clean that, clean this under thing as well. All in here at the brick. Um, like I said, nothing, no building, nothing with the building to do up there. All this concrete down here. 
once again. So the building still, so all this, still all the concrete, which they had some rain, some dirt come on the other day. So concrete under here, and then all of this part, the underpass again, all the way down to the bottom along with the sidewalks. Then we come around here, still all the concrete and the building. This wall, which was like, there's some white stuff left on there, but that junk was like green concrete and it goes around the corner, but that's the scope of the project. All right, so you guys got to see a high ticket job. So that job produced $1,800 within a matter of basically 2.5 days. Um, and it was, I think a total of like 17 man hours. Now, as I mentioned in the video, this was a community project. So this was really about giving back more than it was making money because my original invoice, cause I did the actual calculation of what I would charge if I wasn't discounting. And that would have been about a $4,000 job. Um, once I had that calculation, I was like, okay, what would I be willing to do this for as just, you know, just to give back? Cause obviously there wasn't like, it wasn't about, I couldn't do it for free cause it just, you know, material costs and time. Um, but it was just really about working with their budget cause they had, they had a tight time frame and a tight budget. Um, so they really didn't have many other options to go with if I would have said no. So I figured, you know, I might as well just go ahead and try to work with them as best as uh, possible because there's not many people that they can reach out to in this last minute that has the right equipment and be able to get the job done um, in time. So I was like, all right, bet. All right, cool. Um, would be $4,000, but, you know, I'll knock it on 1800 for the sake of just, you know, to cover costs and a little bit of my time. With that being said, this job came from literally being on Facebook and running Facebook ads. So they see me because I run Facebook ads. So I really emphasize it, guys, run Facebook ads and how you get the type of uh, business, as well as, you know, just having good reviews. Cause people go to my Facebook page, or they see my ads and then they see the reviews. And so that's like a, a double confirmation of, yo, this is the company I need to use. But if you guys are interested, you know, in getting going this year, you're ready to start your pressure washing business. Um, you don't know where to start. You would like some guidance. I'm going to plug my training. I've helped a lot of people um, you know, get off to a good start with their pressure washing business through my um, full full training. You know, I teach people how, everything, all the manual things you need to know about pressure washing, you know, from the chemicals to how to wash roofs, to uh, structuring your business, um, to marketing your business, all that I teach in my course, six Um And this is so, if you guys see my past couple of videos, this offer, it expires on the six. If you want to get in, this is literally the best offer I can make you. Um, it is literally completely a steal. So, if you're interested, uh, I would suggest you hop in now because I'm, this year I'm, my, my price will continue to go up because the past few years, what I've tried to do my best is, is create a product that's not only valuable, but super affordable for the majority. But this year I wanna focus on working with less people. So I'm raising my price, but I wanna work with more serious people, people who are gonna actually take action. So if you wanna get in, if you think this is worth it to you and you're like serious, like, okay, it's something I wanna do. Um, this is, I mean, like you really can't beat this price. It's the cost of a weekend of going out. The other announcement I make, because I started another service because I want to help more guys leverage and get leads with Facebook. I launched a new company called the $99 Ad Club. That's right, you heard it right, the $99 guy. I'm the $99 guy when it comes to advertising. I'm doing it for you guys. Um, and this is going to apply for service-based businesses. So you don't have to be a pressure washing company. I can help you generate leads if you have an auto detailing company, window tinting. I mean, just think of your service-based business. I could probably help you. Um, so if you're interested, I'm going to jump to the website real quick, show you guys. Um, because you can literally go on the website and go ahead and purchase your plan yourself. And we also offer web design. So if you need a uh, desktop and mobile friendly optimized website custom, we can do it for you. So if you actually even seen some competitor websites that you think are pretty good and you like something similar to it, I can uh, pretty much duplicate that website for you. So let's have the website real quick, take a quick look before I end this video. All right, guys. So here is my website. So my company is the $90 ad club. So obviously, so we build high converting ads for local service based businesses. This is kind of an inspiration to ads, literally from running ads for my own company for the past few years and seeing great results. And then venturing off, I started taking on other side clients. So I have an auto detail company and a couple other clients that I do ads for. Um, and I know, if, you know, the formula that I run ads, the way I run ads, it works. And also I want to help you other guys who are not capitalizing on getting lead generation from Facebook because it truly works. And a lot of guys say, oh yeah, I tried Facebook, it didn't work. But it's probably because you're missing some components. Like, this is why you shouldn't try to do everything in your business. Some things you should consider outsourcing to someone else who knows what they're doing. Um, but in addition to this, like the other product I've created with this business is that I also have 
a course that basically teaches the same method I use. So if you don't want to pay me monthly to run your ads, then you can definitely check out the, the course and um, learn how to run ads for yourself. You know, I want to empower you. So I don't want you to just be hostage to my business. But this is like, if you don't want to do it, just hands off, you understand the value of time, then hey, you can hire me. And it only starts at $99 a month. So let's just scroll down real quick and take a look. Um, so services, we offer two plans. So the $99 a month plan, I'll create, manage, um, and run one ad for you uh, per month. Um, so, and you know, I'll, if the ad is not generating leads, I will rebuild the ad for you, right? Um, the other plan is the pro plan. So if you don't just want to focus, if you want to focus on advertising more than one service, so say you want to run, um, you want to run an ad specifically talk about house washing, or you want to run, run an ad talk about like deck washing or roof washing, then you might want to go with the pro plan, uh, excuse me. Then you may want to go with the pro plan because this one is for $2.99 a month. You get up to five ads, um, ad creation, ads management, ad support. So if you have any questions, anything goes wrong, you know, I will make changes for you. And then scrolling down real quick. So you guys who need web design, we have two packages. One is the basic uh, business basic web design. So you know, if you need a website design from one to four pages um, in size, you can get it done for basically a hundred bucks. Custom website, satisfaction guaranteed. It'll be mobile and desktop optimized. And if you need a more custom website, bigger than four pages, um, then this two ninety nine. But if it gets like that, that price can actually vary. So. If it gets like super custom, you want some complex things done, it will cost more than $2.99, but most people will qualify for $2.99 price. Um, and if you need something more than, like I said, if you purchase this plan and you end up needing more than that, then we'll, you know, we'll uh, negotiate beforehand. So there will be no surprise charges. But um, yeah, if you guys are interested, so yeah, you can go over to the, the $99 adclub.com and all these things are just ready for purchase. So if you just click get it now, it'll take you to the purchase page. You can, the purchase page, you can complete payment. Um, and within... 24 to 36 hours, you will receive an email for you to fill out um, all the information needed for us to continue the process, get your website built, or get you up and going for your first Facebook ad. Any questions, guys, you can reach directly out to me on here on, um, any questions you can reach directly out to me by like email or leave a comment under this video if you have any questions I can help you with. I'm promoting this to my audience, you guys first, before we start running ads. Um, for ourselves on Facebook to get you know outside clients, but if you guys want to be an initial client base, um, then you can go ahead and stop now. Like I said, you can't really beat this deal. I made it nine hundred dollars to make it affordable, and I try to do it with everything I create. So if you guys see my digital, my educational products, everything I do is really to try to be affordable, try to help the average person. Um, but I do see sometimes people don't appreciate that. So over time, like prices for what I do will go up, but I always out under promise and I always over deliver th with the things I do. Um, just because I want everyone to have a good experience with um, working with me and <clears throat> working with me and my team. Like I got to put other people who help me out with what I do. But that being said, guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.